Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel Sagittarius I hope you are doing well I hope you're fine and safe and doing good Sagittarius This reading for today It is a collective tarot reading for the Sagittarius sign Let us see what is coming towards you Sagittarius What is the message that is meant for you to know And ready for you to know This is for the Sagittarius sign please Thank you so much guys for supporting the channel. Thank you so, so much guys for coming back. Let's look into what is coming towards you. What is the message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for the Sagittarius sign, please. Thank you guys for your support. This is an open reading for the Sagittarius sign. I want you to think of your situation. Let me just fix my microphone. Um, I want you to think of your situation. Think about your focus. I'll tap into your energy and let's pull um, some cards to look into your psychic reading. This is for the Sagittarius sign. Let's look into your situation. Let's look into your focus. Let's do some energy check in Sagittarius and then the second part of the reading. Let's see what is coming towards you. What situation in love, career, money will come towards you? Okay, what's going to connect with Sagittarius sign? Thank you guys for being here. What is the message for you? Okay. Um... I feel so relaxed when I'm doing your reading. You know, it feels very mellow, okay? It feels very, uh, maybe the next two to three days, um, you could be feeling, like there's a feeling of being mellow and there's a feeling of somehow, you, um, like it, it's giving me a vibe that maybe in the last two to three days, um, you know, some people, some situation, um, it has taught you to be true to yourself, you know, because it feels like I'm, I haven't really started looking into the, you know, the tarot cards, but I could feel a mellow, relax, and confident Sagittarius. It could be that the last three, four, seven days, you know, th you could be choosing yourself, you know. You could be choosing and choosing yourself. You're being true to yourself. And because you're true to yourself, you're confident and you relax. Okay, like there's a, there's a huge relief in being relaxed that things didn't work out in the past. It is not meant to be. And there's more to come. So I could feel that vibe in the air for you Sagittarius and I haven't even touched the tarot cards anyhow so keep you know keep your confident because it makes you feel relaxed and if you relax you trust the process your manifestation is high high vibe and because of that high five to you Sagittarius okay all right now let's go to specific uh, messages in here um, so you're starting the reading with a ten of swords Okay, you have a Ten of Swords and the Death card. This is exactly why I feel so at ease because you're so over the Ten, the Death card in here. You've cried enough. Okay, this could be a relationship situation. Okay, if you look at the Death card in here, you you have spent a lot of time crying. For some of you guys, you have spent a lot of time in the dark. You know. You've spent a lot of time crying in the dark, um, overthinking, but that is over now, okay? You're so over being in the dark, being, you know, being sidelined. Because this is dark, the Ten of Swords, enough of the overthinking, enough of crying, enough of feeling, for some of you, a victim, enough of this situationship that delays me. If this situation ship does not want to stay, if this situation ship does not want to work with me, if this situation ship doesn't want me, no more crying, no more overthinking, no more figuring it out. Because if it doesn't like me, if it doesn't want me, so be it. I am done. Look at the world card in here, okay? The world card is looking into the death card. You are done. 
I think this is a reading where you have maxed out. Like you you come to the point that I waited too long. I've cried. I've spent a lot of time inside my head. For some of you, you could. it's possible that you've been crying for some of you guys. But enough of this, you know. You're growing. You grow like you're you're starting to feel at ease with this situation ship you know like you're starting to feel like you're you're starting to accept that this ten of swords is dead you know like death card okay the situation ship i like it it doesn't want me i like it but it's complicated i like it it made me cry so the equation with the world card is that maybe it's not meant for me so you're th you're starting to accept you know the ten of swords of death you're you're starting to accept like you've mourned you've grief okay like you've you've mourned and grief enough and it's too long to be sitting in the same attitude behavior or situation that does not grow so with the world card with confident and full of you're full of hope you know with the world card in here like there's a part of you that you realize that I cannot control this I can only control myself so I am releasing it I need to be true to myself because I think for some of you I'm seeing like the horn like there's a part that there is it gives me a vibe Sagittarius that there was a part of you that it there was a part of you you know Sagittarius that you're quite stubborn to release it you know like maybe you keep proving to yourself or to others I don't know maybe there's a pressure from society um, that it could still work that it would come it would you know would make its way you know towards you and somehow you're really waiting but it's been so long and with with the with the world card in here you felt like it's you're sitting in something that it doesn't change like it keeps giving you the same engagement reaction so you're taking your power and release there is like the more you release it the more you're confident like the more you detach the more you detach the more you release the more you're confident about where you're going next the more you're confident that there is a next in here with the world card okay so this is a this is an acceptance and your acceptance and release and detachment it brings your power back it brings you're confident that's why I'm really picking up a strong mellow well it is what it is you know with the world card you view it the way you the way the world card view the death card and the ten of swords it looks like you don't want to be part of it or you don't want to experience it anymore or there's a part of you that he I, I don't want to I don't want to feel this you know sunshine you know, if I was your friend you know sunshine I don't want to feel this I don't want to cry anymore I don't want to be in the dark I don't want to overthink I want to find what's next for me uh, the next best for me yeah the Hierophant card I want to I want to find a new you know a new situation that I will be committed and I will get the commitment back exactly it's the devil card you avoid the devil the, yeah you bypass it so you have come to a point where you have come to a point where you've realized that there is power in letting go and power in detaching letting go and detachment it gives you peace it gives you mellow and it gets your power back and confident back and it teaches you a lesson that when it comes to commitment it needs to be reciprocated when it comes to a situation ship there are situation ship that it needs to be equally reciprocated and you're all good with a will of fortune i accept it you know on to the next person adventure maybe job but you're up to a next big thing and look at your current energies in here okay um the hierophant card you also have the hierophant card in here so it's possible that you have committed yourself into a situation where it made you work it made you overthink you gave your world the moon the stars you know but it never reciprocated you 
it gave you the death card it gave you nothing for some of you guys or it was never completed and for some of you it failed and you did not even hear something back from them like i'm kind of give i'm i'm getting a vibe that it failed and you never heard back from them like you've completely figured it out that this person or situation they never cared at all because they never cared at all because you never you never heard back okay so that for some of you that's quite specific or special um so this hierophant card in here this is you okay i could feel this is your energy i could feel that you're recommitting yourself you're being uh you're this this hierophant card you are working into recommitting yourself you know like you realize it's important to stay true to yourself and loyal to yourself so you're recommitting yourself to your values um you're also this is a hard lesson learned from some for some of you guys you know i'm also picking up that you're recommitting yourself and your values and also you're starting to envision again the best case scenario for you okay um because four of cups you don't want to experience this you know you don't want to be the second choice you don't want to wait and wait and wait you don't want a certain like there's a part of here that i don't i don't want the feeling okay i, I don't want the feeling of being a second choice a second hand or the feeling of unrequited love unreciprocated okay you don't want to feel it anymore you want to envision yourself to always be like a best case scenario for you and this is one of the gift of this like this whole thing this whole experience <clears throat> this this whole experience Sagittarius it gifted you to recommit to yourself to your values to your vision that with, a, with four of cups and hierophant card because you don't want to experience that feeling anymore you're going to only involve and commit yourself into person situation where you're gonna get the best case scenario okay um this is the gift like this is the gift out of this situation is recommitting to yourself i'm also picking up that you will take this time as an opportunity to have a lot of practical action and consider security and practicality versus being spontaneous okay with the four of cups and hierophant card here okay so that's very very strong that's very strong in here like the page of cups it's it's been done i don't know i'm i'm getting i'm getting that there are some you know there are some there are some decisions that you're not proud of yourself you know like with the page of cups uh you made you made some you made some decision that you were not proud because it has led you to feel this way but you're being kind to yourself you're being kind to yourself or at least that's the advice to you sagittarius is that be kind to yourself because even though a part of you made a mistake like you made yourself cry you definitely learn the lesson and the biggest gift is the lesson you know the, the the gift of this whole thing is learning the lesson that you will never put yourself again in that kind of situation with the page of cups like this is like a soft pledge to your higher self that i will be true to myself and to my value and i will never you know put myself again into that situation i don't know what this is but it made you cry like it made you cry it is a cry for help a cry from your soul so you're like no i will never put myself into that situation again and one way to do that is to always recommit to myself be true to myself the importance of my values and always always move you know in cases where what's in it for me the best case scenario for you so there's a huge lesson learned from that that thing or person or situation 
that thing or person or situation that made you cry or at least it was you know for some of you it could be a finance thing but it it's it almost like crippled you okay like it immobilized you okay but you survived and you're more confident and you're stronger you're able to detach from the situation the page of cups in here reminds you to be kind to yourself Sagittarius you're getting stronger okay you're getting strong you're getting stronger and stronger okay and not only that um, there's a change coming you know we're moving from the Taurus season we're entering the Gemini season now I think it's I, we're entering the Gemini season now I think it's Gemini season now and so you're, you're getting power you're getting your power back in one way or another you're gonna get your power back okay so just be kind to yourself page of cups now the second part of the reading wow that was quite heavy okay but it is it is what it is it is what it is uh Sagittarius now what's coming towards you okay what is coming towards you Sagittarius what is uh what's the situation ship that will connect with you or or will uh, unfold in the next two three four weeks for you um you have a seven of pentacles in here and this magician card like this feels brand new and you have a two of cups you will shake hands Sagittarius seven of pentacles um I'm really getting a strong vibe Sagittarius that you have to open up yourself to others um, I'm kind of picking up that you could be for example you could it could be that you keep hanging you keep stay like you keep going to that place or you keep going to that same group or somehow in like the universe is giving me this that like I'm kind of picking up a very strong psychic feeling Sagittarius where you know involve yourself into group into people connection or pleasurable activities um, work or social that is first of all aligned to your values and also quite new so and also with seven, seven of pentacles explore things that you have not you know because like open yourself to others open yourself to a new grocery store you know like you could be going to that same place to that you could be going to the same place to the same grocery store the same person like the universe is telling you invest into a different route invest into something a different a different activities involving different person whether it's work or social I'm also picking up that you would you could be invited because I feel like this is pleasurable activities I'm hearing the word um, involve yourself into fun adventurous and also something pleasurable something fun something light and it's connected to social your friends and also it's connected to work so you might want to volunteer at work volunteering at work could lead you to meeting other people um, for some of you you could be I'm um, oh, I'm really picking up a place Sagittarius where you could you always go to this place why don't you try the other grocery stores I don't know why in the age I would say <laughs> grocery stores it could be a metaphor that you always go to this place why don't you try the different area because there's something that you would discover in there okay and the two of cups this is very mysterious this is a mysterious handshake or there is a mysterious secret admirer or secret offer and they won't tell me like I'm being blocked like because this is you know what if you're a psychic you could like okay you can group this okay this this connect connect but this one is like different and they're, they're telling me you this is a, this is a mysterious secret but amazing offer to of cups so you have a secret offer coming your way and it is a two of cups so it could be an offer of love an offer of reconciliation or it could be like a, a new job but this is something that there's a flower in here there's a two of cups and there's a flower this so this is something that's gonna happen without a problem 
okay there's no drama there's no issue you would shake hands you would have a mutual connection there's no block and I don't know why I'm seeing like I'm smelling mint you know the smell of mint or you know that when you it's weird <laughs> when you brush your teeth it's mental mint I don't know why I'm picking up that vibe you might kiss someone Sagittarius <laughs> but there's a mint or someone smells mint or fresh okay I think it's just starting to like this two of cups it's building up as I deliver it so that's probably why it's blur for me to read because normally when things are activated when things are sure psychic can predict that it's like okay this is sure to happen there's a solid like solid thoughts and energy that we could deliver this one is quite you know so it's, it's quite hollow but it's starting to solidify so that's why I, I can't read it that much but it is great okay two of cups so for now as this two of cups unfold you do a lot of pleasurable fun involve yourself into others other activities try other places other activities because you might who knows you might get into this two of cups in there so this is what i have for you sagittarius thank you so much for connecting with me thank you so much for being here i will see you soon again guys you have a great day bye bye